If you're curious to know how it is the first month to be in a Kreuzberg, I believe that Carolina has a lot of good insights for you. Yes, I have. Thank you so much for having me, Sergio. <laughs> It's a pleasure, Carolina. So probably before we go, how you did have an impact in your first month, we could explore a little bit what exactly is your position with us? Yes, um, I'm a delivery manager. Um, that's a role um, quite similar to a key account manager. Um, so on the one hand, I have focus on um, hard KPI stuff like budget and timings, and um, I have the direct contact to the customer. Um, but on the other side, uh, as delivery manager, I'm a sidekick for the developer team. So I'm very close to the developers, to the Scrum Master and the, um, <clears throat> the product owner. And um, yeah, that makes it a very nice function because I have very operational stuff and also very strategic topics. And so it really never gets boring. I believe that given that description, you have some expectations about what is going to happen during your time with us. So what do you expect from the future? The aspects that um, excite me the most um, being a delivery manager is like um, really being at the same time for the customer on the customer side, but also on the team side. So for instance, I would say a regular key account manager is only working on hard KPI stuff. And um, being a delivery manager at Turbine um, means working also together with the team, taking also care about the team um, and the team dynamics and the team hygiene. And um, this is something that uh, I like a lot because um, we're not machines, we are humans. And um, I think in the role of a delivery manager, this is something where I can live my strengths. And um, yeah, I have uh, a lot of joy until today. In these past 30 days, where is the moment that gave you this, this joy? Do you have some that you would like to highlight? Mm -hmm. um, well, since I, I had the luck to start at Turbine in the month where the breakout week um, yeah, was, um, I, I had the joy to see all the colleagues in person in Berlin. And this helped a lot um, for my onboarding, of course. But also after the breakout week, um, talking to the people in, a, in the remote way, like we are right now talking to each other, it gave me a totally different feeling on how, how to work together, how the people really are. And um, this gave me somehow a lot of security that, that I'm fine um, and that, um, yeah, it's, it's cool to be part of, of the team. You have been telling us amazing things about your first time at Turbina. So the question is, what does the future hold? What are your expectations between you and Turbina? Um, I think um, we have a very good future um, waiting for us. Um, on the one hand, um, we have very nice clients, um, which is awesome to work together with. New clients are coming. And uh, one thing that excites me personally a lot is um, that for Turbine, it's a strategic goal to empower females. And um, yeah, this is this is really great to, to see that um, women in tech are coming. And um, I think there is a, also a big wave of very well-educated women waiting to be hired. And um, this is great to, to have the feeling to be empowered and um, also to empower new coming um, employees, women, and yeah, nice people. To finish our great conversation, I had a pleasure talking with you. How would you describe to being in one word? I would say charming. I wouldn't even say anything else. That word, I believe it's perfect. Thank you very much, Carolina. It was really a lovely conversation and I hope to see you soon. Thank you so much for having me, Sergio, and have a nice day. Have a nice day too. Ciao. Bye. As you see, I'm smiling, but inside I'm like, yes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, I totally can recommend uh, working at Turbine um, because I, I never have the feeling that um, as I can like 
that a question is stupid I am asking or um, if I want to join um, a meeting that is not totally dedicated to my role as a delivery manager, nobody says, no, that's not your responsibility. It's more like, yeah, I think you have good ideas. Come, come join us. And um, so this is for me a kind of sign that um, the, let's say, things that you know are always welcome and you are not put into a kind of box with a label and you can't get out of the box because you are more than that.